Hey everyone, welcome back to Anxiety Art Adventures. Uh, today I'm going to do an unboxing, Diamond Art Club. Uh, this is going to be a gift. I'm not going to say who it's for because uh, they might be watching, but I want to try and get this one done by the end of the year uh, for Christmas. I have this one and one other one that I'm trying to do as gifts. I uh, don't know if it's going to happen, but I'm going to try. So anyway, this is from Diamond Art Club. This is Catching Dreams by Chuck Penson. It is a 71 by 56 centimeter so you can see if my camera will focus oh my gosh my camera y'all my camera here we go catching dreams so it's basically a water scene with sailboats at like a port it's really really pretty Okay, so I'm going to open this. Hope everyone's having a fabulous day today. I am going crazy, uh, T minus four days before kitties get here. We're super excited though. Super, super excited. Don't worry, they will hopefully be on the channel. So, yay. Um, okay. So for those of you that are new to Diamond Art Club, uh, these are your drills. We'll go over those in a minute. Uh, this is your um, toolkit that you get with Diamond Art Club. With a round kit, you get a standard uh, drill pen, you get a squishy two heart-shaped waxes, and a clear tray. Um, there are a couple of baggies in there, but um, obviously not enough to do your entire, um, your entire kit. That's okay. I have plenty of other baggies uh, that I use to kit up with. So, or you can use a storage container. All right, and here is your uh, sticker inventory sheet. Uh, this is really nice. This shows you it's a better image of what it is. Isn't that just beautimus? Beautimus. Yes. So this one's pretty big, 71 by 56. Uh, it's got 47 colors. It is a round drill kit. So, because you know how I feel about squares. I'm not gonna do squares anymore. They are too frustrating for me. And uh, diamond painting is supposed to be fun. Not frustrating. Uh, diamond Art Club includes this in every kit. It's step-by-step -step instructions for those of you that are new. They give you a nine step instruction on how to do it. They also give you a discount code. Okay. All right, so it's gonna go this way. Wow, look how pretty that is. Sorry for the glare, but it's got plastic on it. Okay. Uh, let's see if I can put my light over here in the corner. Keep it somewhat down. Okay. All right. So that is the image pretty much in its entirety. There's a little bit down at the bottom you're missing, but you've got a beautiful little cottage here, the water, the sailboats, um, like hills back here. And it's pretty sunset. So yeah. Okay. So with every diamond art club, I know I say this every time, but I know there's some new people to the channel, so I want to make sure they know. The Reed Diamond Art Club, you get a legend over here on the left, and you also get a legend in the bottom right. Um, the newer canvases in the on the very bottom left corner, usually down here, they'll put the title of it of the canvas and the artist. Um, but this is a somewhat older kit. I've had it for a little bit, a um, couple of months, I think. Um, I just, I've never opened it. And then of course you have your schematic right there. And then it gives you all of your, your DMC um, codes and your symbols and you know, your numbers. So, um, Love the canvas. The canvas is always super soft, lays out wonderfully, uh, nice and sparkly. And we are going to do the symbol test so you can see 
how clear the symbols are. Always really clear. Sorry for the glare. Always really clear symbols. Um, and if this one, this one does have ABs. It has, it looks like two ABs, uh, 134 and 141. So we'll find those when we go through the drills. All right, let me move that so it's not so glaring. Isn't that pretty though? Um, yeah, this is gonna be an awesome gift um, to someone, so yay. All right, drills. These are a lot of colors, 47 colors. So it's almost 50, 50 colors. So yeah, it's gonna be a lot of confetti. Oh, I didn't do the stick, the sticky test. I've gotta do the sticky test, y'all. Okay. Hear that? That is your typical Diamond Art Club sticky noise. I have never had a problem with Diamond Art Club not sticking. I know some people have. I've never had a problem with uh, DAC not sticking and I've never had a problem with running out of drills so um, you get what you pay for um, I know I say this a lot and I get a lot of shade for it and people thumb down my my videos I don't really care um, it's a view you know um, I diamond art club to me is the best place to buy um, diamond painting not just for their quality the quality is amazing and there are other great companies out there with great quality but it's how quickly you get them it's you know it, their customer service is phenomenal i just they are my my first go-to now right now they are having issues with keeping things in stock due to covid and that's completely understandable and i do not fault them in any way for that um, i am willing to wait to get my Diamond Art Club uh, cuts. I'm willing to wait a, a longer than normal to make sure that I get good quality kits. Um, so for those of you that are new to diamond painting and have never gotten a Diamond Art Club, I highly recommend you to get one. Even if it's just a small one, just to try it. Um, because once you get one of these, it's, it, it's just refreshing. That's the best way I can do it. Um, because I started with a really crappy Amazon diamond painting that I had problems with the drills sticking and they were popping and all of this. And then I got a diamond art club and it was like, whoa. Okay, so I am gonna bring this down. Um, let me turn that down a little bit so we can see the drills. Oh boy. Hopefully my camera is not going to be a cutie. I looked for a new camera, but right now there are no Logitech cameras due to COVID because everybody um, was getting them for working from home or um, for school, you know, people um, doing school at home for their kids and stuff. Okay, so we're going to go through this and hopefully my camera... So whenever they come back in stock, I'm going to try really hard to get another Logitech. Okay, we've got three, seven, seven, eight. I've got two bags of that. It's a pretty orange color. And we've got three, seven, seven, one. With a peach color. I only have one bag of three ton. Whee! Uh, three, eight, six, one. Seven, two, seven. Three, eight, five, four. 327, 355, uh, 550, that is a beautiful purple. I know it looks blue on camera, but it's it's a purple, I promise. Uh, 3799, 413, 743, 890, 904, 3830, 699, <clears throat> excuse me. 3864, 754, and 3776. The first batch. We're gonna go this way. Okay. 3855, 3860. Another bag of 3860. 779. Uh, two bags of that. 
And these are accent beads, they're in smaller bags. Uh, 796, 775, 738, 321, 3350, 155, 648, 498, 333, 843, 841, 907, 3841. Uh, here is the first AB, 141. Uh, for those of you that aren't familiar with AB, it is um, Aurora Borealis, and that is a uh, shiny sparkle glitter coating they put on the drills. Really pretty. 436. Uh, 134. There's the other AB. It's a green. Green AB. The sparkles. Sparkle should. 317. 3770. 905. 414. I guess. Those are your 47 colors. Oh my goodness. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So yeah, the goal for this is to hopefully have it done. Um, let me go back up so you can see it. Um, hopefully, gosh, I can't even get it all in camera. Um, hopefully have it done by the end of the year so I can give it uh, the Christmas gift. Maybe that's better, easier for you to see. Um, that's the goal anyway. But, <coughs> excuse me, Woo. sorry about that. Um, yeah, so looking forward to doing this one. Let me know if anybody has this kit uh, by Chuck Penson, if they've done it, if they love it. I absolutely think it's gorgeous. It's got those pretty like orangey colors to it. Um, you know, water at sunset, really pretty. Uh, the person that I'm giving this to loves the water, so um, I'm hopeful they will enjoy this. And uh, I haven't decided yet if I'm going to frame it for them or if I'm just going to give it to them and let them frame it. Because putting something uh, of this size in a frame, y'all, talk about expensive. Um, I looked at framing the black horse I did from Diamond Art Club. And I mean, it was going to be, to have it custom framed behind glass, I think it was going to be like over a hundred dollars. It's like, what? <laughs> so I've got some, um, basically freestanding frame where you clip one to the top, you know, one up here, you clip it and then one down on the bottom and it hangs. Um, we're going to try that and see how that works. But anyway, wanted to show you this. This is Catching Dreams by Chuck Penson. Ooh. Isn't that just fabulous? Fabulous. I love Chuck Penson. I really do. He's got such, he's such a wonderful artist. He does beautiful work. So anyway, wanted to show that to you and I'm going to have some more unboxings coming up for you uh, next week. Uh, since kitties are coming, I'm trying to get a bunch of videos done ahead of time and just have them uh, put out for you uh, so that I'm not trying to do videos and and uh, handle new kitties at the same time. So trying to be a little proactive. But anyway, I hope everybody has a wonderful, wonderful week. And thank you so much for watching. If you're new, please hit that subscribe button, ring the bell so you know when I put up uh, these videos and other random videos. And I want to thank all my Patreons. Um, Y'all are awesome, amazing. Um, I always do a a card at the beginning of each video showing all the patreons so thank you so much for all of your support love you sugars i will see you again really soon bye guys